Uh, welcome everyone to my 2022 wrap up. Uh, this is this is solely about the channel and me personally. Uh, I will have a video coming soon of all the movies I saw from 2022, but that will probably be up on my second channel. I do tend to upload those to my second channel, but uh, 2022 video coming soon. Uh, all, all the movies I saw in 2020. Well, all, all the new movies I saw in 2022. All of the movies that were released in 2022. Coming to my second channel pretty soon. Um, so, let's start off with the channel updates. Um, first off, the, the obvious one. The one you're probably all wondering about. Jimmy Neutron. Uh, the scripts are... The, the first draft of the scripts are finished. Uh, as soon as I'm done here, I'm going... I'm going through those scripts, I'm cleaning them up, I will probably be recording this by the end of the week, and then the Jimmy Neutron videos will come out as I finished editing them. Look forward to the Jimmy Neutron videos in the very, very near future. We are on to recording and editing. Uh, other channel updates. I said this in my Drunk Ranking Christmas special. But moving forward, Drunk Rankings will be on my second channel, Matt 2, The Mattening. They're just a little uh, low effort for this channel. You know, there's not a lot of editing that goes into those. There's not a lot of production that goes into those. It's mostly just me drunkenly ranting about movies. And you know, ranting about random-ass movies is all my second channel is. My second channel is just, here's Matt giving a whole bunch of unsolicited movie opinions. So, the second channel feels more like where Drunk Rankings belongs. Uh, so, moving forward, Drunk Rankings will be on the second channel. And, of course, there's uh, Matt's Funtime Weird Movie Show. So, I have an episode I might do in January. Uh, really, really depends on whether or not I get around to it. After that, Matt's Funtime Weird Movie Show is taking an indefinite but not permanent hiatus. There are at least two other videos, I at, at least two other reviews I intend on making before this series is over. I am not ending Matt's Funtime Weird Movie Show. It's just, it's getting a lot less attention this year. Um, honestly, I, it's, I, I don't want to say you'll be seeing less of me in the coming year. I think you'll probably be say, seeing about the same amount of me in the new year. I just think it's going to be less frequent. I think I'm. I, I want to focus on like bigger, longer content. Uh, in the, like the twenty-minute episodes, and even I say twenty-minute episodes of Matt's Fun Time Weird Movie Show. Those episodes have been getting shorter and shorter recently. Every now and again, it's just like it's something I wanted to talk about, but there's not that much to say. There's like just barely enough for like a fifteen-minute episode. Um, also just, like, I, I, I'm getting up in years. I've, I've really started to feel a lot older lately, and I, 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 I feel like I'm reaching that age where it's just not cool to be angry anymore. Um, not that I ever relied too heavily on, like, angry reactions to stuff, but, like, I don't know, my content's gotten a lot less edgy over the years, um... And, and pr probably rightfully so. <laughs> Matt's Fun Time Weird Movie Show will return. It it is not over and done with. It's just, it's it's mostly a matter of like I I'm going to do Matt's Fun Time Weird Movie Show when I have movies that I want to talk about for that show. I'm not just gonna keep producing episodes of it even when I don't really have any ideas. Uh, if if I make an episode of Matt's Fun Time Weird Movie Show. It's going to be an episode I want to make. Otherwise, I'm focusing on bigger projects right now. Uh, like like the Abed video, like the Jimmy Neutron retrospectives I've been working on. 
Uh, I'm already working on another video that's kind of like the Abed video, where it's it's me reviewing a bunch of movies in a row. I, I have to watch like a, a whole bunch of movies, and then I'm reviewing them all in one long video. Uh, and as for Jimmy Neutron, I, I do have an idea of like something similar that I want to do when I'm done with Jimmy Neutron. So yeah, moving forward... Expect to see a lot more long-form content. Expect to see a lot more... Uh, yeah, a lot more stuff like the Abed video. A lot more stuff like the Jimmy Neutron video. That's that's just where I want to put my focus right now. It's the content I want to make right now. Um, Matt's Fun Time Weird Movie Show. It'll come back. There will be other stuff that I do with that series because there is some stuff that I just want to talk about and that's like the perfect format to do it. That's really the the thing here is like I have all these different outlets to talk about film um, and Matt's fun time weird movie show is like such a narrow part of that that uh, like, like I because I, I can only talk about one movie at a time. And I have to talk about them in a very specific way. So, yeah, I was, uh, moving forward, I will use Matt's Fun Time Weird Movie Show when I need it. Uh, and as of right now, I don't really need it. Uh, I, I still would like, I st like I said, I still have at least two episodes planned. And even then, like, if I were going to end the series, I would want to do something really big to end the series. Um, <clears throat> now that really big thing might happen, you know, there, there might come a point where I'm like, all right, you know what, this series is officially over, here's the big finale, and then we're moving on. But, uh, we're not there yet. We're not there yet. I'd like to keep Matt's Fun Time Weird Movie Show around. It's just not the focus anymore. I guess that's all I really have in terms of channel updates, um... So if, if you're just here for like, okay, let's see what's happening on the Matt Presents channel in 2023, there it is. Uh, more long form content, less Matt's Fun Time Weird Movie Show, drunk rankings are moving to the second channel. Still more Hollow Victories. Hollow Victories will continue coming out on this channel. Uh, second Tuesday of every month, or first, first Tuesday of every month, excuse me, first Tuesday of every month. Although it might be worth moving that to like another day of the week, like maybe... Thursday, second, the first Thursday of every month. Oh, 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 another channel update. I remembered another one. Uh, I'm, my, my streams on Twitch, the movie night streams on Twitch, they are moving from every other week to once a month. It will be the second Friday of every month will be uh, movie nights on Twitch. Also, I've, I've been streaming the, the Jimmy Neutron video games, and I would very much like to continue streaming games on this channel. I, I think it would be fun to keep doing video game streams. I ran a poll to see what people think, like, if, if people wanted maybe a second channel for, for the video game streams. Uh, and it seemed like most people who had an opinion, like most people it seemed didn't have an opinion, but of the people who had an opinion, most of them were saying like, oh, put it on another channel, put it on another channel. But honestly, I, I think my friend Michael has convinced me to keep it on this channel, uh, because like, it's not, if, if you just, if you're new to my channel, if you're not subscribed and you scroll over to my videos on YouTube it's going to show you my regular uploads. There is a separate tab for my live streams. And the fact that YouTube keeps those live streams separated is kind of what's making me think, eh, let's just keep it on this channel, you know? Like, I've already got all my viewers and subscribers on this channel. Let's, let's not try migrating to a new channel just for the streams since it's it's not like it's cluttering up the channel if it were like cluttering up the channel if it was like oh look at all these video game streams and you know no, none of my actual content was showing up uh then i might think twice about it then i then i might consider doing a, a second channel for my gaming stuff but as of right now i think the video game streams are going to continue appearing on this channel Maybe that really bothers some of you, but I—I I mean, like, if if it's that obnoxious, let me know. But I—I I don't, 
I think it, it's fine to just have the streams on this one, but part, partially because, like, you know, I've already got these viewers, I've already got these subscribers, maybe they'll tune into a stream that's on this channel, where they maybe wouldn't if they had to go find it on another channel. Okay, yeah, I think I think that's everything. As for 2022, I said going in that it had the potential to be, like, the best year of my life so far. Uh, I, I would say... 2022, probably on par with 2021. I definitely hit some higher highs, but I also hit some lower lows this year. A lot of shit going on. It, it, it feels like, uh, you know, everything going to shit has finally caught up with me. <laughs> you know, like it's finally starting to, okay, yeah, yeah, now I'm starting to feel the effects of everything going to shit a few years like because like 2020 and 2021 i was fucking thriving you know i i i was doing great during the pandemic now that the pandemic's over i'm running into some issues man honestly truthfully i, I here's the thing i'm moving this year i am moving from texas to wisconsin in less than a month at the, at the end of january I am moving out to Wisconsin, and it feels like, as much as I have enjoyed my time here, as much as I have enjoyed the three years I've spent here at my <coughs> apartment, the three years I've spent in this apartment has been great. I've loved my time here. It feels like I might have overstayed my welcome a little bit. It feels like it's it's time for me to move on. And that, like, it's kind of been time for me to move on for not too long. Probably since, like, September or October. That's when, that's when I really started to feel like, okay, uh, it's, we're, it's time to, it's time to move on. It's time to, to move on to the next phase of my life. You know, I've enjoyed it here. I've loved being here. Every phase of my life since, like, middle school has gotten better, right? High school was better than middle school. College was better than high school. And this was better than college, which is kind of shocking to me, because I loved college. I loved being in college. And I, I just, I'm so happy with how I've been since college. I, I think I've really found my place in the world. I'm a lot happier uh, in this portion of my life. So maybe it'll be even better. I hope so. I certainly think it could be. Um, it's 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 definitely got the potential to be. But uh, my my more more to my point was, I just I'm kind of ready to not be here anymore. <laughs> I'm kind of ready to move on. I'm kind of ready to move out. Like because you know. I guess it's like I said, I was I was kind of thriving during the pandemic, and now the pandemic's over, and it's like, well, time to, like, recuperate, start my actual life, I guess. <laughs> you know, put, put, little, put a little, like, three-year delay on starting my real life. But, uh, you know, it was fun. I had a lot of fun. People I want to shout out this year. Obviously, I've got my friends at the Exploding Duck Brigade. Uh, Chris, Michael, Mitzi, Zach, Teddy, uh, the whole gang. Um, very happy with them. Very did 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 some good work with them this year. It's a lot of fun. I I enjoy hanging out with those guys. I got sampled on like an experimental album this year from uh, Princess Dank. <laughs> Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll drop a link to it, like, down in the description. Uh, I think I'm, I'm in it at, like, the 17-minute mark. That's about when I pop up. Maybe 18. 18-minute mark? I don't remember. Um, I'll, I'll put it right next to the link. I'll, I'll say when I show up. Uh, shout out to Peyton for, for appearing on an episode of Hollow Victories. Thank you for, for that, Peyton. Although I, I thanked him in that episode too. And you know, like like some of the, the exploding duck people have also been on uh Hollow Victories, but I already Yeah, I already shouted them out. Michael got me like a custom Hollow Victories mug, but right now it's sitting in my freezer because I filled it up with rum for an end gag and I haven't finished the rum that I and I, I can't I can't like pour the rum back into the bottle. I'm just like 
nope, no, the we're we're drinking rum out of this mug until you, as long as it's still in here. <laughs> And I still got rum left, so I, I can't... I, I mean, I could go over and pull it out and show it to you, but it's it's full of rum. That's what the the Hollow Victories mug is doing right now. How have I only been going for 19 minutes? I feel like I've been talking forever. Holy shit. I mean, I, I, guess, I guess my end-of-year message doesn't have to be a long one. I guess I don't have to talk too much. Uh... I don't know, I'm looking forward to 2023. I think 2023 is going to be a very different year for me. And, well, I, I know 2023 is going to be a very different year for me. So, you know, uh, looking forward to what the future may bring. Um, cautiously, cautiously, but, you know, looking forward to it. I'm optimistic, especially for this channel. I'm... I'm really looking forward to some of the things I'm putting out on this channel this year. So, uh, I, I guess, Happy New Year. Thanks for seeing me through 2022, and uh, I, I hope to see you all in 2023. Um, good night. Have a good one.